So this is the ACE Tri Panel Bar Kit, which I've installed today. It's going to convert the bike more into a cafe racer style sort of machine. I'm happy to say that it comes as a whole kit. It's got the clamps, it's got the bolts. The only bolts that I have to reuse are the four that actually hold down the handlebars and the two that come up from underneath the triple clamp. The only worry that I can see is this um, little bracket that's meant to be holding up the um, brake fluid reservoir. I'm not sure how that's going to fit into the whole equation, but I'll get to it when I get to it. The first thing I'm going to do is just take off the existing handlebars, unscrew those four elements, and just to see if the new handlebars will actually fit. They won't jam against the fuel tank or the mirrors won't hit the fuel tank. I'm going to use use aftermarket round mirrors, so that should be okay. I know that the whole kit will lower the handlebars, move it forward, so hence, uh, before I start taking stuff apart, let's just check that it works, that it fits. It'll definitely fit, and uh, I'm going to go through with it. Slowly, I'll just start removing everything. clamps themselves, 14 mil ratchet. I'll go from underneath, unscrew these. There seems to be some sort of washers there, so I won't take that bolt out. I'll just replace this thing straight away without you know messing around too much. So this is pretty much the home straight, but what I'll do is I sort of seem to lock myself out. So I'll take this part of the handlebar off just so I can slide everything else on it. I had to backtrack. I actually stuffed it up. I had the handlebars reversed. This is the left hand side. This is the right hand side. Right hand side's got these two holes in it. This is the hole. The hole closer to the edge is the one that holds the accelerator in place. There's a latch, I know there's a latch here somewhere. Now just uh, tighten everything up and uh, adjust it accordingly. I think this will have to go a little bit more like that. Yeah, like that, something like that. So in conclusion, the bracket for the master cylinder I didn't need to change because as you can see it sits upright or more or less upright. I suspect it's for the 900cc version. The other issue I had was the clutch cable. It's a little bit tight but the clutch still works. It doesn't slip so it's good enough for me. I'm not going to do any more with it. And there you have it. Thanks for watching. Until next time.